We'll guide you through how to fix iPhone storage full. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Over time, your iPhone storage will go and fill up and eventually it'll be full. The first way you need to go and open up your photos like so. So there are actually two different ways we can deal with this. The first way is by deleting them. So you can click on select in the top right and start selecting photos and videos. You'll find that videos take up more space, especially the longer ones. So what you can do is go and start selecting them like so, and you can then click on the delete when you're ready and delete the two videos. What's super important is, is you come back to albums, scroll down and click on recently deleted and you empty this out. Click on select in the top right and the three dots in the bottom right and delete them all if you're ready to, to actually delete them from your phone. Alternatively, if you don't want to do that, you can just go and store them in iCloud. So go and open up your settings, come right to the top of your settings and click on your name. Then go down and click on iCloud and in apps using iCloud, click on photos. And what you can do is sync this iPhone and this will store your photos and videos in iCloud. Depending upon how many you have though, you will need to go and upgrade your iCloud storage for more data and that will, will cost money, but it saves you from deleting the photos and videos. The next thing we can do is come back to your settings. Just come back to the main settings page, scroll down and click on general, then click on iPhone storage. If you scroll down here, you're gonna see the apps which are taking up the data. So I can see that Call of Duty here takes up so much data, I don't really use it. So what I can do is click on it and then click on delete app. So what you can do here is sort that list by the space used, as you can see size, and you can then delete the apps you don't use which take up the most space. After you've done that, you can then come back to your main settings once again, and you can scroll down to Safari just here. And then what you can do is go and scroll down and go and click on clear history and website data. You go and find that Safari website data and just history will take up quite a lot of space. So you can go and clear that. You can choose a time frame. Obviously, the longer you select, the more data will be deleted and the more storage you can gain. Now, after you've done that, what I recommend you do is perform a force restart on your iPhone. This goes and refreshes everything and just fully deletes the files you've gone and deleted. So what you can do is press the increase volume button, the decrease volume button, and you hold down the power button. Your phone screen will go black, but keep on holding it until you see the Apple logo, then release it. Your phone will start again, and now hopefully you've got some more storage. 